Okay, I'm back playing Skyrim. I haven't played in a while, so. <coughs> Let's go see what Dawn God has for me today. In a while, but in a few days. Really? It's just a normal bunny now. He used to be bad with adept, I used to attack you instead of. I haven't seen a normal bunny in so long. Wait, I think we're going the wrong way. I have no idea. Or not. Alright. I think I just took a detour. Come friends, come, follow me. What did I do last time on my game actually? I don't remember <laughs> any of that nonsense. Alright, let's go in here. Still here. No. You've got us all here. Now what do you want? Just check I'm recording. Alright. Hold it right there. What are you doing? Making sure you're not bad. Can't be too careful. I will dawn black dawn Is whatever. It tea time? Dawn Try not to set anything on fire, all right? I will kill you for this. Powerful vampire. Unlike anything you've seen. Why'd you come here? I will destroy you all. Ah, kill the dawn god. Kill the dawn god. Bone armor sloppy. How dare you recruit me! How dare you! Die! Die, Ox Gun! Die! Jurak! Come on, this way. Into the mud. <laughs> I know your power. Don't hide from me. That's She's here. He's coming for me. I should really run, shouldn't I? Probably. Run. <laughs> Not even I will. <laughs> full team, full health. <laughs> I have succeeded. Okay. So let's head off to... Just gonna go in there and be like, Hey, has any of you guys seen a math priest? A math priest? Have you seen a math priest? I haven't seen a moth priest. <laughs> Get it, it's funny. No. Alright. Let's go, go, let's go. Still here. <coughs> Hello 
old friend. So you're good with destruction. Imagine falling down there and then having to walk all the way back up if you survived it. Let's try it. Run! Dragon! Oh. oh shit, shit, I'm not gonna survive that. I'm not gonna survive that. There's rocks everywhere. <laughs> he said do. <laughs> I'm weird. Alright. Back of it. Back of it. Alright. The dragon's attacking! I should survive that, no? Apparently I'm not quite as strong as I thought. Now, where's this dragon? Guys, can you guys hold a dragon? Someone do something! Good, you're ready to attack a dragon. Everyone's showing his ass. By the line of vines. I will don't break a bitch. No, I will. I'm referring to my face and possibly my other womanly assets. I have your soul. <laughs> I am Archmage here at the college. The college should inform me of any new arrivals, really. <sighs> Especially if a moth priest just happens to walk through the door. We have survived difficult times. Or better made. I shall explain to you the mysteries of the outer realms. Mm -hmm. Until next time. May I just say it's a pleasure to have you leading the college, really. So stand at me. May you Archmage or not, my rules about books still stand. Moth priest? What an oblivion do you need a moth priest for? See that? It's called an Elder Scroll. Fine, fine. No need to get your britches in a twist. The obvious answer is to go to the Imperial City. The Moth Priests make their home in the White Gold Tower. Sometimes they go out looking for Elder Scrolls. Lucky for you, there's a Moth Priest in Skyrim right now, doing just that. He stopped in to do some research in the library, then left for Dragonbridge. If you hurry, you might catch him there. He's after my dragon skull, the one I'm supposed to get to kill all of All this knowledge all might on? have been lost were it not for you. No! Mm -hmm. There are few... That incident in Morthal was just. Let's see if they can teach you some, some of what I know. But be careful. Run! He's gonna steal my Elder Scroll. That's mine. Mine, I tell you. It's all your mine. <coughs> I 
must be stopped. What was that? Run! Uh, I'm not going fast enough. Got to thinking. Destruction magic's fine. Just don't go burning down any buildings. Be careful. Hello. I'm hoping to run my own in some. How oh, none of you can tell me jack shit. Much more nice. Okay, did you see a moth priest? Are you a soldier? I don't know what a moth priest is, but I did see an old man in a robe not long ago. He's riding in a wagon with some imperial guards. They didn't stop to visit, though. They rode through town, heading south, and went across the big bridge. It was only just a little bit ago. I bet you can catch them if you hurry up. If I hurry up? Oh. Until next time. They were in the period guards, they were vampires. Team, run! Who have I got these days? Oh. <laughs> I am old, you know. Quick save. Alright, let's go. I don't have any horses at, at anymore for some reason. That reason. <coughs> One of you stole a horse. Don't worry if I die. Phew. Okay, what press is it? <laughs> Just over here. Oh, they were actually the Imperial Guards, okay. Oh yeah, that's right, the vampires attacked the couch, didn't they? Getting a little bit wet. Perhaps it would be a good idea to find <sighs> Malchus. Who's Malchus? Elta. Whoever he is, I'll finish him. I'll finish them all. Typical. I hate the rain. It makes my hair go all frizzy. And it makes me all wet right down to my undergarments, which is really uncomfortable when I walk. Uh. It's too much information. Way too much information. Run, dear, run! <laughs> four bears. I almost thought that said four beans. I'm just like, what? Four beans? <laughs> it's four bears or some shit. I don't know. Alright, let's go save a moth priest. Let's go save a moth priest, yeah. Let's go save a moth.
death on there. Alright, we're gonna need a bow. Ah, this won't do my back. Alright. <laughs> um, we have the. Where's the bow? Um. What's it called? Punisher. The Punisher. It should be at the bottom. Oh, the bow then is the Punisher. Wait, we're gonna need some arrows too, though. Okay, in case it's not there, I'll just grab that bow. I'll scroll down to the bottom. There should be an ebony bow known as the Punisher. I made it quite a while ago for undead. It's mostly for summoned undead, but it's still an undead weapon. Alright, let's do this. Let's take out some death hounds. <gasps> Shh, stay down, everyone back. Back. Shh, he's gonna see one of them. Okay, good, we're hitting. Oh, I think I just tried something rather unsavory. Do I see anything over there to shoot at? Try shooting at that, that might come alive. That's a problem. I'm gonna just quick save quickly now. Oh shit. <laughs> Get back. For this bother. Watch it! I used to be a better bow match, just haven't played this game in so long. Look, Henny. Ah! No, down here, one is driven to the most interesting. <sighs> Damn, I missed. Damn it, I think they found us. Come on team, let's move. Fire! 
Oh no, it's just stone. Kill him. I fought worse than you. You're no. I got this. Oh my god, so it's so annoying. Okay. Shit, we headed the wrong way. That's fine. Just in time. I think those vampires were getting hungry. <sighs> I'm quite all right, thanks to you. Dexian Evicus is my name. I'm a moth priest of the White Gold Tower. These vampires claim they had some purpose in store for me, but they wouldn't say what. Probably hoping to ransom me, the fools. You do? All right then, enough we mysteries. We need to find Morgazim the Powerful and question him. Question him why? Why me? You have an Elder Scroll. Remarkable. If my knowledge of history serves me, I recall that the Dawn Guard was an ancient order of vampire hunters. I will be happy to assist you with your Elder Scroll. Uh... Just tell me where I need to go. You're not taking it back to Cyrodiil ever. Very well. I'll hurry on my way there before more of those vampires turn up. Thank the Divines for you. It is our sacred duty to study the Elder Scrolls. We read these ancient scrolls of prophecy in order to divine the future, and we use that knowledge to aid the Emperor. Sometimes, we venture out into the world in search of more scrolls for our library at the White Gold Tower. That is the very purpose that first brought me to Skyrim. It is the great spire at the heart of the Imperial City, among the tallest towers in all of Tamriel. Which scroll are you the lower for? floors are home to this the Imperial Council, fray, and the Order of Moth Priests occupies the middle floors. The tower suffered damage in the recent war with the Altmeri Dominion, and is not what it once was. I hope one day to see it restored to its former glory. Not as much as I would like. Even after spending decades of my life in study of the Elder Scrolls, they remain a great mystery to me. It's true for most of my brothers in the Order as well. We don't really know where the scrolls came from or who wrote them. What we do know is that some are born with the special gift to read the Elder Scrolls. These chosen few can divine events of the past and future within the scrolls, though in time, it drives us to blindness. I'm afraid there's not much more to tell. 
Even today, the Elder Scrolls remain a great enigma. Ah, oh, this is all more excitement than I'm used to. His name's Corpse, apparently. I don't get any of it. Let's go. Don't want to spend any more time in this place than I need to. Well, first go, go. Okay, so the problem is fixed now. Let's go. My mother must be waiting on the other side of that thing. Let's go. My mother must be waiting on the other side of that thing. Let's go now. I'm soulless! <sighs> Could I do a way off in there? I'd say a little bit faster running it. Seeming you can't have horses in the soul can unless you summon it. <sighs> there is one horse you can get. I feel ugh, the smell here. Let's try to handle this quickly. There's a smell. I don't know. Whoa. I have not been here in such South. a long so far, time. About what I imagined. Wow. It's beautiful. Hello, friend. Why can't I just. This is no place for you. I know, friend. Damn, Akaviri Shaman. How could I know it would trap my soul? You say the most innocent of things and they all get the wrong idea. I suppose you're a bit like that as well. <coughs> Stay away from the Oblivion Gate, I told them. Did they listen? Of course not. And your soul got trapped in here. How do we get in? So I haven't been in here in ages and I've forgotten like most of the stuff. <laughs> a lot of it I didn't actually do properly. I was doing a back when I used cheats and stuff. Stay away from the oblivion gate, I told them. Did they listen? Of course not. The oblivion gate? You're talking about the oblivion crisis. I see. You'd think a vampire would be right at home in this place. You'd be wrong. It'll look like Let's just find my mother and get out of here. Okay. Before the they're living crisis. Most of these guys did. I mean. Ah! Bowen man! Come on! Yeah. Bring it! <laughs> All right, break you don't go. Break him. Don't break him. Yeah. Fear my sword. And the danger lord behind it. But you will not live another day. What am I 
doing here? I don't belong in a place like this. You must help me find my Arvac. He doesn't deserve to be in a place like this. Oh god, everyone's like the same here. Yeah. Arvac, my horse. We came to this horrible place together. We were attacked by monsters, so I told him to run. Please, okay. he's such a loyal creature. And he's been running for so long. You have to save him. A of place course. like this will change you. Arvac! Arvac! Where are you? Arvac, please come back! Come back! I will find your horse friend. What is your name? Okay. <coughs> I will find his Arvac. I feel terrible for the dead who end up here for eternity. It seems awful, like they're still suffering. And that up there looks kind of like... Sovereign God thing, except... Let's darker. Let's keep moving. I feel like we're being watched. We are. I think I've heard it's werewolves are absolute beasts when it comes to a full moon. Oh. I better make sure I'm carrying a second set of clothes. Oh god. You know, just in case you start tearing them off or anything. You are disgusting. Da 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 Avac! Avac. I yearn to see the great dunes of Hammerfell once again. Quick save, follow Avac. What the fuck? I've never seen Avac here like this before. <sighs> he's probably supposed to lead you to where his skull is. Well, look what we have here. Let's just say I sold something to a guy who turned out to work for a whole coven of necromancers. How in the name of Zenith was I to know the ingredients were phony? Do I look like someone that would double cross a necromancer? No. You got it. Horse, wagon, and all. Plumped here without so much as a word. I used to be one of the best traders in High Rock, you know. People would track me down just to see what I had for sale. Very funny. And what exactly are you going to pay me with? Take a look around. Gold doesn't exactly win you any friends around here. I'll tell you what. I appreciate what you're trying to do, so I'll play along. The only thing I see around here in abundance are soul husks. Uh, you know, those ugly fungus looking things growing out of the ground. Bring me, say, 25 of them, and you can rummage through what was left on my cart. Odds and ends I've gathered over the years. Well, used to gather, before all of this nonsense happened to me. Tell me what you're looking for, and maybe we can make a deal. If you have the husks. Alright. <laughs> You've still got it, Morvin. A salesman even beyond the end. Daedric Lord to earn that armor. If that doesn't scare or at least impress people, then I don't know what will. This armor? Not this armor, not the sword yet.
I bet I have to do anything at this time, man. <sighs> Just take on a whole heap of vampires and... Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that's not anything. That is pretty big, I guess. My followers are just running around the soul gun like they're nothing. Like it's nothing. Well, technically I've only got these two in the soul can. Alright, come on. With me, ladies. I wouldn't rather have two any other two of my followers with me. The horse is back! Follow the horse! That's a trap! Ah, I don't know what to do here. Okay. Maybe. We could just pay the toll another way. It wants a soul, so we give it a soul. Yours. My mother taught me a trick or two. I could partially soul trap you and offer that gem to the ideal masters. It might be enough to satisfy them. It would make you a bit weaker when we travel through the soul cairn, but we might be able to fix that once we're inside. I can Maybe. travel through that fine, I'm pretty sure. I'm sorry. I wish I knew a better way, something that would be... Just know that whatever path you choose, I won't think... I know that better than anybody. Have you made up your mind? I know this isn't an easy choice. Take your time. Okay. I'll come back in a few years. Have you made up your mind? <sighs> My second game I play, I'm going to be becoming a vampire. Are you sure? I'm not I'm becoming to do it, a vampire. But you need to right think now. it through. You'll remain mortal. But you'll find yourself weakened within the soul cairn. <coughs> I know this is difficult for you. I hope you trust me. Yes, I never I trust do anything you. that could hurt you. Oh my god, stop flirting. Let's just do it. Thank you. Let's not waste any more time then. I promise to make this as painless oh my god, as possible. Oh god, you're a vampire. Your mother Let's owns do. this place. And... Shit. Got oh, millions of dead bodies. What's that sound? Oh, the balcony, right? Looks like we're going back in, guys. You, I go out that way later to fast travel the way the hell I want to go. It's a quick way out instead of going all the way back through the fortress thing. <coughs> For all the catacombs. Let's take it all. Nah, 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 nah.
and quick save. Get the ingredients in that vessel and let me know when you're ready. Not that I ever saw. My mother had a bit of a thing for magical constructs. Not... not what you're thinking. She just found them fascinating. Dexian said something about that scroll. What was it? Something to do with dragons, I think. Maybe we should try asking at the College of Winterhold. Sounds like something they'd know about. <coughs> it's in Black Ridge. Not that I ever... My mother had a bit of a thing for magical... I had no idea her laboratory even existed. She had an alchemy set up in her drawing room. But nothing that even comes close to what's here. <laughs> Looking at the equipment and materials, it looks like she was trying to advance her necromancy. I don't know. Certainly not longevity. Kind of a waste of time for a vampire. The Soul Cairn is a tiny sliver of oblivion, the realm of the Daedra. It's ruled by unseen beings known as the Ideal Masters. Honestly, I don't know. Necromancers are always interested in souls, though, so that probably has some kind of interest. That's. I think that makes me a necromancer because I use so gems a lot. I guess we kind of have to go way back to the very beginning. Do you know where vampirism came from? Moloch Bow. Exactly. The first vampire came from Moloch Ball. She was not a willing subject, but she was still the first. Molag Bal is a powerful Daedric Lord, and his will is made reality. For those willing to subjugate themselves, he will still bestow the gift, but they must be powerful in their own right before earning his trust. <coughs> the ceremony was... degrading. Let's not revisit that. But we all took part in it. Not really wholesome family activity, but... I guess it's something Oops. you do when you give yourselves to a Daedric Lord. <laughs> um, only that Daedric Lord because he's fucked up in the head. I'm not sure it's really your place to judge me. Yeah, to judge is. us. My sure family is. has its problems, but they're our problems. Too bad. Let's just move on from here, okay? Don't. Just leave me alone for a bit. I'm sorry, did I strike a nerve? Nobody really knows. As far as I've heard, I've read you give the Ideal Masters so Because most of the stories end with the Ideal Masters duping the necromancers, who end up dead or wishing they were dead. I had no idea her she had an alchemy set up in her drawing. Looking at the equipment and material. I don't know. Certainly not longevity. Kind of a waste of time for a vamp. That's... a long story. I guess... We kind of have to go way back. To the... Exactly. The first vamp... Molag Ball... Checking out what the other options of the channels. He will still be... Nobody's ever asked me that before. I... I don't know. I think... Mostly, I hate what it's done to my family. Well, you've met most of us. My father's not exactly the most stable, and eventually he drove my mother crazy with him. And it all ended with me being locked underground for who knows how long. By your mother? It's definitely been a bad thing, For your the whole. protection. A cure? Why even think of it that way? I can't think of any reason I'd want to lose this gift. Especially after what I did to get it. It may have driven my family apart, but I'm still here. And I'm alive. I won't give this up. 
You had sex with more like Paul. Get the ingredients in that vessel and let me know when you're ready. Didn't you? That's disgusting. Then the rest is up to me. Are you ready to go? I'm not entirely sure what oh, this thing is going I haven't to do played I this since blood. I've looked up all that lore. Now that I know all that lore about Moloch Bowl and about the other dangers and stuff, I know what they're like. Moloch Bowl being the Lord of Domination and all rape and shit, it's pro they probably did. Come to think of it. Of course. What is it? I've been asking myself the same thing since we came back <coughs> to the castle. She was so sure of what we did to my father. I couldn't help but go along with her. I never thought of the cost. Possibly. I guess even a vampire mother is still a mother. She worried about me. About all of us. But she wanted to get me as far away from my father as possible before he really went over the edge. Yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I just didn't expect anyone to care how I felt about her. Thank you. Are we ready then? <coughs> Alright, here goes. Yes? Alright, let's move. It's time. Just be careful. Oh god, oh god. Incredible. All of Nan's about to tear in half. Run! Let's rewatch that happen, shall we? I didn't click quick save, did I? So beautiful. It's tearing my soul apart. Are you alright? That looks painful. Pocket? I felt it when you brushed against me. <coughs> now that I think about it, I should have expected that. Sorry. It's hard to describe. The soul cairn is. well, hungry, for lack of a better word. It's trying to take your life essence as payment. There might be. But I don't think you're going to like it. Vampires aren't counted among the living. I could probably go through there without a problem. Not your first choice, I guess. Just simply move away from it. He's very much alive. <laughs> Quick save time. Alright, let's go. We're this getting close. I'm this sure. Oh my god, no one! Die! 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 Ugh! <sighs> 
You can hear him. One of these cargoes is about to come alive. Or two. the top yet. I bet there's some kind of secret passage around here. There always is. Look what I just found. So I know I found a new armor. Hello. I need to have vampire garnets. Wherever the hell you find them anymore. What the hell? That's We're getting close. I'm sure of it. Oh, I can add a body part. Can I just have funny body parts? Now this, this is weird. Why would there be a ladder up to it? If it wasn't gonna come alive. And a dragon skull? Who the hell killed the dragon and even put it in here? They're vampires or pizza. Alright, let's have a look at the map for clues. This way, apparently. Somewhere. Hmm. Leave it to my mother. Always smarter than I gave her credit for. I've got your back. Let's move, people. You never know when you'll need linen wrap. Never. For fuck's sake. So you're good with conjuration. Okay. Why don't you conjure up a big mammoth wearing a hat? You can do that. Oh, I what wonder do where that, this then? goes to. Look at this place. This has to be it. Let's take I everything they are. I mean, she taught me everything I know. But I had no idea she had a setup like this. Oh. I wonder what I just created. Look at all this. 
She must have spent years collecting these components. And what's this thing? Paul. Oh, journal. I'm not sure about this circle, but it's obviously something. I'm right behind you. You're back. Get out of the way. Imbecile. Paul. Let's take a look around. There has to be something here that tells us where she's gone. Why are you sneaking? You found her journal. Let me take a look at it. Whoa. Any luck yet? You did? Let me see them. I only know what she told me. She had a theory about soul gems. That the souls inside of them don't just vanish when they're used. They end up in the soul cairn. The soul cairn is home to very powerful beings. Necromancers send them souls and receive powers of their own in return. My mother spent a lot of time trying to contact them directly. To travel to the soul cairn itself. Why? That circle in the center of the room is definitely some type of portal. If I'm reading this right, there's a formula here that should give us safe passage into the soul cairn. Why would a handful of soul there? gem shards, some finely ground bone meal, a good bit of purified void salts. Oh, damn it. We're also going to need a sample of her blood, which, if we could get that, hmm, not bad. We'd better hope that's good enough. Mistakes with these kind of portals can be... gruesome. Why is there no anyway, enough of that. Skyrim? Let's get started. It could oh, tear in it a Mother hole would have plenty throughout. Of those materials in her laboratory. No, that's we'll not worth them. it. The sun will know, not, definitely not worth it. Wake up! Stop daydreaming about me and which way going. We'll just have to let the old man rush. Men say they wouldn't mind piercing me with their arrow or stabbing me with a sword and then walk. Okay, so I've changed the quality, so I'm gonna have a look at what it looks like now. Okay. As you can see, looks particularly better. So we're gonna head off. Okay. Check out my armor. I look epic. Oh, spoiler alert for those who don't like spoilers. Um, also a bit of an easter egg. This flask got my back. As you can see, it kind of looks like a Thelma made thing. It's also got that red dot in the middle. Kinda looks evilish like a vampire would own it. Ah, uh, spoiler now. I think it could be t t symbol. I could. I think it could be like an Easter egg to do with the fact that um the last snow elf, the last two snow elves. One of them's a vampire. I think it could be a spoiler, uh, Easter egg to that. I think. I don't know exactly. It'd be cool if it was, though. Now, what you do here is you just put the missing quests in. I'm telling you, there's something strange with the moon dial. So, is it true what they're saying about you? Perhaps you could show me what really happens when a dragonborn comes? Good god. Very clever, mother. Really? Yeah, this. <laughs> I've never been in those tunnels before, but I bet they'd run right under the courtyard and into the tower ruins. Well, at least we're getting closer. Let's, Let's move. Go. Dun, 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 dun. 
What's the dead word? <coughs> Attack. Attack! Wait, why are you using an elven dagger? I can give you far better weapons than that. Sharana. This must be that beautiful Skyrim weather I've always heard about. You've only got a little queen calling your nose compared to the rest of the vampires. And you're one of the older ones. Why is that? And yes, you can turn her human at towards the end of the quest lines. <laughs> well, after Hulkon's dead. <coughs> uh, I'm not going to. Because I like to have a vampire follower. And I don't want to be in a human. She looks weird as a they did a lot of more work on her as a vampire than they did as a shrew. Oh, MG. Oh my god. <coughs> did your mother do all this? Because this is messed up, man. I've never even seen this part of the castle before. Be careful. I don't know what might be around. Match my age and power the castle. Oh, God. Hey, fuck hands. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Might be able to take that one out really quick, save quickly. Oh, God, do I to try again. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna put on novice difficulty. I could always get away with powerful weapon. But... Shit! He saw me. They all did. It's war! Oh, I love a challenge. Guess you'll have to do though. Oh, that was fun. Ah, run, run, run! your ground. You can't attack us all. So. As a werewolf, do you prefer the taste of man meat? I, I mean, do you prefer feasting on men or women? We're getting close. I'm sure of it. The guy go comes to. Oh no. I'll just... Such is my power. Where'd you come from? I knew it. I was once trapped in the other side of the castle. And back when I only had one follower, Serana, she was on the other side of the castle, too busy to help me. 
I just gotta go chasing me around the entire palace. Because at the time I had weak weapons and stuff. But it's no good at defending gargoyles. <sighs> open, open sesame. Open the sesame. Good God, just open it already. All right, this way. to go anymore Okay, this is looking a fair bit better. As we said. Okay, let's do this. The symbol the that flask thing there on my back kinda looks Falmery with a and the red dot thing on it kind of looks like a vampire mark thing. <laughs> it's really weird and confusing. Although it could be an easter egg to the whole snow elf being a vampire at the end of the dawn card. Oh, um, that's a spoiler alert. Um, yeah. The snow elf's a vampire. You don't want to know it right now. Yeah, if you didn't know that, um, so I probably shouldn't. Yeah. Oh, bloody catacombs. Alright. No, no, no. this place? Everything's been torn down. The whole place looks. Well, dead. It's like we're the first to set foot here in centuries. This used to lead into the castle's great hall. Looks like my father had it sealed up. I used to walk through here after evening meals. It was beautiful once. This was my mother's garden. No, no, calm you know yourself. I know I'm irresistible. She would have hated to see it like this. Wait. Uh, a 
Oh wow, where is it? Something's wrong with the room. Some of the crests are missing and the dial is askew. I didn't even know the crests could be removed. Maybe my mother's trying to tell us something. Or maybe they, she just took it out and hit them so no one find her. I mean, necessarily she could have destroyed them if she wanted to never be found. So you're the strong silent type, huh? I bet you must love me talking to you all the time. Then again, who could resist spending time with me? Whatever you say. Now. The quality of scam looks a little lower than it usually does. I should probably put the graphics up a bit more. it now and I'll put the settings up a bit more so the game looks a bit better okay let's get going okay this way we are trying to show we hit first Let's move. Miss me, miss me, no, you gotta kiss me. Oh god, this place is so confusing. Now which door? That door it is. Okay, so I uh, mean Castle of Valhalla going to the Soul Can, and if, uh, anyone who's done the quest line will know you'll walk into this area with piles upon piles of bodies. Damn you! Dead humans. Beast races, just anything you can imagine. Just bones up and bones up and bones. Up and bones. Let us confuse and disorientate them. If you were to get all the people from Skyrim now and chuck them in a room, all their bodies, it would probably make up enough to, fit, to look like this. There was no way in hell that there were that many people back in Skyrim in those days. So, I don't know where they got all the bodies from. Damn you. Unless of course there was. Just say left. 
So what's right? How many people did you guys say you killed? I think they're right. You're a savage, you need to be put down. I mean, look at all these bodies. Got on a leash and go killing my friends. Let's move. Greetings, orc. I'm glad we're finally taking the fight to those. What are you looking at? An orc. What are you looking at? Isn't it ugly? Curse two times. Oh. This better be good. Used to be high elves. Then you name just have to chime or move to Morwen. Since when people die. Got cursed to become the Dark Elves, and then you guys if you die naked, were like half of the entire naked. race of the oh, Dark sorry. Elves. Decided to believe in new gods, which is as well with the Dark Elves in the first place. And then they were cursed and became the Orcs. Half of the Dark Elves, or a quarter of them, some of them. Anyway, from what I understand, from the lore. Chimer just kept getting cursed. Yeah. Vivek managed to keep like half of his chime self. Hi. Hi. Yisran knows how to fight those You're monsters. Nord. He's Why been preparing for this day for a long time. We should talk scare. You know that we should talk. Let's move troops. Oh my god. Let's go to the soul can. Just cause we can. Apparently. Let's go to the soul can. We're after the soul can. The wonderful soul can of. Yeah, wherever. Let's go. Let's just go. Come on. Let's move. Oh, we don't, we don't, which way do I need to go? Do I have to go through the fort? Serrano, so which way? Yes? What did you need? I can't wait to see the courtyard again. Oh god! Alright. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you gotta swim it. I f hope. <laughs> I'm going down. Just for some fun. Just for some fun, just for some fun. All the way to the bottom. So fun. I went swimming yesterday, so my character can go swimming too now tonight. He can hold his breath longer than me. <laughs> Probably. No, you can only keep holding your breath, mate. Let's see, it should just be around the corner somewhere. It should 
just been here by the member right. <laughs> Alright, let's get on land and walk it. Right on. Go, go, go. Oh, we're going to stop landing. Damn it, what sounds like nipples? What? Do you have something to say? Let's not hang around then. Okay, so clearly I don't remember the way in. As I said before, it's been a long time. I'm pretty sure I actually have to go in the fort though. Oh, I'm here. Never mind. We made it. The big heaven. Everyone's Nick mode immediately. Because of that. What are my settings on right now? <coughs> Alright, let's move. Snake guys. Quick save. Ah! Oh, yucky. Something is coming for me. Sick. Okay. Let's go. You guys hold them off. I'm going in. Also change my weapon to Yes, what did you need? Alright, let's move, whoops. Kick save. Oh, sorry. Come on, Chow. Who's there? Oh, <laughs> shit. Ladies, ladies, everyone calm down. Stop fighting over me. I'm gonna have to quick glide. Just banging. Out of the way. Alright, I'm running it. Run!
really a torch or something. You think you stand a chance? Retreat, you idiot. You're a thing called a feral vampire power. Whatever that is. You're gonna turn me into a vampire, aren't you? No, you're not. It's that red spell of those, I'm pretty sure that turns you into a vampire. If that cast it long enough, you start getting vampiric opponents. Let's go. Okay, there we go. Now. Take care of yourself. Let's get this crap off. We need a bit of light. Right, quick save. I think Dawnbreaker is perfect for Dawn Guard, I guess. Now. We'll also have to go and enchant my armor as well. I'm pretty sure there's a enchantment table over there. are just one big game like someone is sitting there playing with us like some adult plaything no really no I don't mean that kind of adult it makes you think though um, this is help me she's insane I'm using this bitch. Get out of the way. Get out of the way, gunner. I'll check for any items that I need to learn enchantments of. Do you have a moment to talk? I try to avoid it. Always seems to end in an argument. You? Why do you think I was asking? Do you have a moment to talk? In a minute. Jesus. Oh, crossbow. Let's enchant the crossbow. Do you have a moment to talk? Oh, I can't do two enchantments anymore, can I? Do you have a moment to talk? God, I can't do two enchantments. Just do hang, hang on a sec. I'm not going to enchant it yet then. Oh, I could. Do you have not yet. Alright, we won't enchant it yet. All right, what do you want? Do you have a moment to talk? Sure, what is it? That moth priest, Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. Yeah. I think I know where we can start looking. I know where one of them is. You know where the other one is? Half cool. the people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. That doesn't exactly make me want to open up. I got a warmer welcome from my father. And that's saying something. Hmm.
Ever since he decided to make that prophecy his calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. That's because he needs your blood. means to an end. He is planning on we killing you. We need to find you. my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. Ah, uh, yes, that's The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, some place he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. Besides, I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. And he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? The soul can. Wait. That almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too... peaceful. Oh, absolutely. But my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. True, but I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. I think that's our way in. Don't let me stand in your way. I'll be at the dock whenever you're I'm ready. Right behind you. Oh, I'm ready if you are. Screw it, I'll just come over. It's around the side of the castle. Let's move. I was gonna go get the other scroll first, but apparently we're getting this one first. Alright, I'm gonna make sure my quests are active. Ah, oh, that's a lot of quests for the Dawn Guard at once. Jesus. Alright, let's go speak to Isran. Isran, you come here. Dog I used May your good next day, fight bring you well. This way. Let's move. I knew it would come to this one day. Lay down. Who said something? Soreen or Gunmar? I thought they'd have learned their lesson by now. I don't trust that man. I don't. And I don't want him here. I suppose she's right. I shouldn't let my personal feelings get in the way. Yeah. Last I heard of him, he was aiding the vigilance of Stendar at Runvald. That's he great. may still be there. If he can maintain some appearance of normalcy, I'll allow him to stay. Alright, let's go get it. I heard a lot of vague nonsense. You could interpret that a hundred different ways. Only thing that stood out for me was Ariel's bow. That's a powerful weapon, and I sure as oblivion don't want the vampires to get hold of it. The Moth Priest can stay here for now. As for the vampire, I still don't trust it. So keep it on a leash. Sure. Keep your eyes open. Okay, here we are. Whoops, I didn't want that one to play. Shit. I bought too much. The two of them just never got along. That's why Isran didn't have you go looking for him when he sent you after us. Oh, I am. Uh, Hope you're getting along with Isran. It takes some getting used to. If you're putting yourself in harm's way, you'd best be prepared. Take these. What are these? Working metal isn't easy. Let me show you a few things. Isran had a surprising stockpile of weapons and armor. Take a look. Yeah, I don't need that. Don't need that. I'll need that. <coughs> and that. I'll take that. 
And do you have Dongar weapons? No. That's sad, dude. That is sad. Good, you've got Dongan armor. I'll see which one suits me the most and then I'll put something on. Oh my god, there's so much of it. There's so much. I'm just gonna buy all the music. you could find a moth priest so quickly for the reading just let the old man know when you're ready I knew it would come to this one day there's only one thing worth remembering when it comes to vampires if you're sloppy or careless you're dead and good people will die because of you I've lasted this long because I don't take chances I cover my tracks and I keep my eyes open. If you're smart, you'll do the same. Stay alert. You just blinked. Your eyes are open. Uh -huh. My trip to Skyrim has become quite the adventure. Are you a blade? It's good to me. Ah, hello there. If you are. What can I do for you? Descendant of a blade or something. Ah, my rescuer. It's good to see you again. It's not exactly the hospitality <coughs> I'm used to, but your man Isran has seen to my needs well enough. And might I add, this is a remarkable fortress. I have colleagues back home that would love to study this place in detail. Not gonna happen. Oh, most certainly. Let's find out what secrets the scroll can tell. Now, if everyone will please be quiet, I must concentrate. I see a vision before me. An image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. He's making it up. Now a voice whispers. We should kill him now. Among the night's children. A dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, darkness will mingle with light, and the night and the day will be as one. The voice fades and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, oh, yeah. I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. I must rest now. Oh, great, great, great. The reading has made me weary. Come Lies! On. You should get some rest. They're all lies. I wish I could help. Normally, I'd send you to the Imperial City in Cyrodiil to seek answers at the Imperial Library, but that avenue no longer exists. The Elder Scrolls vanished from the Imperial City around 175 of this era and have been scattered across Tamriel by forces unknown. If you want to find the remaining scroll, you'll have to consult with someone versed in magical knowledge. Perhaps at the College of Winterhold? 
I am the Arc Mage of the College of Winterhold. If anyone's going to know where it is, it will be me. It's in Blackrage. One of them. <laughs> Funny. Of course, I know it. Alright, I'm supposed to talk to Serana, but before I do that, I've got to go buy some armor and stuff from these guys. Do you have a moment? Gunmar and I have been talking, and, you know, we're slightly worried. What about? We both realized that if Isran's even allowed us in here, he must be really concerned. Yeah. And if he's that concerned, the situation must be pretty bad. Make sense? Yeah. I'm just gonna check a recording. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, cool. Five minutes. <laughs> yes, these vampires are a new threat and a truly deadly one. Gunmar and I agree that we're going to need Florentius to help. Gunmar and I have a lot of work to do here, so we were hoping that maybe you could track him down. Who's Florentius? He's a priest of Arche. Well, he was. It's, it's complicated. He's a little eccentric, but we can trust him, and we can definitely use his skills. <sighs> well, that's the thing. We don't know where he is. We haven't seen him in years. Okay, I'll search for him. I think he had regular contact with the Vigilance, and I know Isran kept track of them. So maybe you could ask Isran if he knows anything? Just keep in mind that he... Well... He might not like the idea. Oh, uh, what's he gonna do? He needs to end a weapon and kill me with it? Well, this isn't exactly a pal. I suppose I'd rather be here than most other places and... I wonder what we're up against here. It's sort of a random assortment of things. <coughs> See anything useful? I have a lot of money from spin. Okay, I don't have that much left actually. Well, it's a fair bit, I guess. From selling all the um, spells that I had from the mods. So I'll just spend a bit of time buying some stuff. And then I'll re keep recording, okay? Okay, so we just left the um, cave thing, so now we're gonna travel back to Fort Dawnguard. Just gonna fast travel. <sighs> Should I take a minute? Alright. This way. I could spend hours in a soul can. Let's do the quests, we can come back later and finish off the other things. <coughs> Mother! Be. Serana? Is it really you? I can't believe it. How do we get inside? We have to talk. Serana, what are you doing here? Where's your father? He doesn't know we're here. I don't have time to explain. I must have failed. Harkon's found a way to decipher the prophecy, hasn't he? No, you've got it all wrong. We're here to stop him. To make everything right. Wait a moment. You've brought a stranger here. Have you lost your mind? Have you? You're very nice to your daughter. No, you don't... You. Come forward. I would speak with you. For the way I understand so it... how has it come to pass that a vampire <coughs> hunter is in the company of my daughter? It pains me to think you'd travel with Serana under the guise of her protector in an effort to hunt me down. Excuse you? I'm not here to kill you. Coming from one who murders vampires as a trade, 
I find it hard to believe your intentions are noble. Wrong. Serana has sacrificed everything to prevent Harkon from completing the vampire. prophecy. That's just. I would have expected her first. to explain that to you. <laughs> Wanna finish this shit first? You think I'd have vampire. the audacity to place my own daughter in that tomb for the protection of her Elder Scroll alone? The scrolls are merely a means to an end. The key to the tyranny of the sun is Serana herself. When I fled Castle Volcahar, <coughs> I fled with two Elder Scrolls. The scroll I presume you found with Serana speaks of Ariel and his arcane weapon, Ariel's bow. How do you the know? second scroll declares that the blood of Cold Harbor's daughter will blind the eye of the dragon. Like myself, Serana was a human once. We were devout followers of Lord Molig Ball. Tradition dictates the females be offered to Molig Ball on his summit. Few survive the ordeal. Those that do emerge as a pure-blooded vampire. We call such confluences the Daughters of Cold Harbor. It was expected of her, just as it was expected of me. Being selected as an offering to Molik Ball is an honor. She wouldn't have dared turn her back on that. Molik Ball is a bad danger, not a good danger. It's, it's what not. some call the domain of Molik Ball, his place in oblivion. Your cultists. Now you're beginning to see why I wanted to protect Solana. And why I've kept the other Elder Scroll as far Oh, you're worse than the mythic cop dawn. Jesus. If Harkon obtained Oriel's bow, and Serana's blood was used to taint the weapon, the tyranny of the sun would be complete. Cool. In his eyes, she'd be dying for the good of all vampires. <coughs> and how exactly do you plan on stopping him? Kill him. If you believe that, then you're a bigger fool than I originally suspected. Don't you think I weighed that option before I enacted my plans? Apparently not. You care nothing for Sarah or our plight. Whether or not you've become one of us in order to survive the Soul Cairn, you're still a vampire hunter at heart. You're here because we're abominations in your mind. No. Evil creatures that need to be destroyed. Wrong. I'm aware of you. Idiots. <laughs> you idiots. Serana, this stranger aligns himself with those that would hunt you down and slay you like an animal. Yet I should entrust you to him. This stranger has done more for me in the Stop lifetime of my life than subject. How dare you! I gave up everything I cared about to protect you from that fanatic you call a father! Yes, he's a fanatic. He's... changed. But he's still my father. Why can't you understand how that makes me feel? Oh, Serana. If you'd only open your eyes the moment your father <laughs> discovers your role in the prophecy. That he needs your blood. You'll be in terrible danger. You're holding your hands like it's an evil plan of yours. You decided to shut me away from everything I cared about. You asked me if hiding me in that tomb was the best course of action. Let's just let us to talk it out. Follow you blindly. What is it? Both of you were obsessed with your own. Let's not hang around then. Motivations might have been different, but in the end, I'm still just a pawn to you two. I want us to be a family again. I figure it is an Easter But I don't know if we can ever have that. Maybe we don't deserve that kind of happiness. I'm sorry, Serana. I didn't know. I didn't see. I've allowed my hatred of your father to estrange us for too long. Forgive me. If you want the Elder Scroll, it's yours. That's a complicated game. Your intentions are still somewhat unclear to me. But for Serana's sake, I'll assist you in any way that I can. 
My attentions are to protect all vases. That includes vampires. Yes. I've kept it safely secured here ever since I was imprisoned. Fortunately, you're in a position to, to reach take the down that surrounds these ruins. Danger. You need to locate the tallest of the rocky spires that surround these ruins. At their bases, the barrier's energy is being drawn from unfortunate souls that have been exiled here. Destroy the keepers that are tending them, and it should bring the barrier down. <coughs> Sounds hard enough. All right. One more word of warning. There's a dragon that calls itself Dernevere roaming the cairn. Be wary of him. The ideal masters have charged him with overseeing the keepers, and will undoubtedly intervene if you're perceived as a threat. Cool. So ideal masters will feel that I'm a threat. <coughs> as you've been traveling in the Soul Cairn, your body has become attuned to it. Let's just say, a tiny part of you rubbed off on it, and in its place, a bit of the soul cairn filled the void. You should find no difficulty using the portal any longer. That's nice. Harkon's vision is a world plunged in eternal darkness, where the vampire can flourish, and never again fear the tyranny of the sun. What he fails to realize is how much attention would be called to our kind if the prophecy came to fruition. If eternal night fell, there are many who wouldn't stand for it. They would raise armies in attempts to return things to normal. The order of the day would be our destruction, until every last vampire was hunted down and eliminated. I do. It's how the vampire has survived for millennia and the only way we can continue to survive in the future. When I entered the Soul Cairn, I had intended to strike a bargain with the Ideal Masters, <coughs> the custodians of this place. I requested refuge in the Soul Cairn, and in exchange, I would provide the Ideal Masters the souls that they craved. If I had foreseen the value they placed on my own soul, I would never have come here. The Ideal Masters unleashed their Keepers and sent them to destroy me. Fortunately, I was able to hold them at bay and retreat into these ruins. Unfortunately, yes. Since the Keepers weren't able to claim my soul, they had their minions construct a barrier that I'd never be able to breach. Time has very little meaning to me. Consequently, it has little meaning to the Ideal Masters as well. 